already know who it is back at another video for you guys today so we're gonna be checking out another trailer it's mostly about trailers today this one is called awake so um i don't know if this is about people being uh, you know asleep and then now they're wide awake okay shout out to katy perry or like on some woke shit and I'm black and I'm black and I'm black. But by the thumbnail, I don't think it is about that. So it says, because some, somebody had an issue that I read the description of some other movie trailer I read too. Like that's the point of why it's there. So you can know what the hell is going on. Duh. So let's read it. Chaos ensues after a global event wipes out all electronics and takes away humankind's ability to sleep. Hmm? But Jill, Gina Rodriguez, problematic at times an ex-soldier with a troubled past may hold the key to a cure in the form of her own daughter sleeper survival watch awake on netflix june 9th that's coming up y'all so let's check this one out shall we in about a three two one all electronics sleep? huh dang i'm not tired what a world no light all the shooting stars nothing are you sure them shoot stars or them missiles? Those are satellites, Noah. Oh. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, no! Oh, my God. How the hell did they get one? Power's out everywhere. Cars, too. Fifteen hours ago, something happened. We don't know what caused it or why it occurred. But what we do know is that none of us can sleep. After 48 hours of no sleep, there's a loss of critical thinking. It's going to be total chaos. Get in. But what about after five or six days? We're all going to die if we don't solve this. Let's go, let's go, right now! Oh, oh, I'm trying! Hands up, get out! Don't shoot! Hands up! Don't shoot! Hands up! I can sleep. I can sleep. We need to get your daughter to Murphy. She could be key. We should sacrifice her. She's my oh, daughter, uh -uh. and she's coming with me. Not. You be strong, okay? We're not giving up. No one is attacking us! Our survival depends on her. Let's get to work. Well, y'all. Let me read this again. Chaos ensues after a global event wipes out all electronics. So no lights, no TV, no radio, no phones, no internet, nothing. Just dark as fuck, I'm sure. And takes away humankind's ability to sleep. But Jill, an ex-soldier with a troubled past, may hold the key to a cure in the form of her own daughter. That lady, though, she would have got slapped mess with me talking about, so maybe we could sacrifice her. What in the Illuminati hell is you on? You ain't sacrificing shit. You could get your ass up there, take you a sleeping pill, and go to bed, take you some melatonin, bitch, and leave my daughter the fuck alone. The fuck you on? Talking about, oh, we could sacrifice. <laughs> get your ass down, bitch. <laughs> wrong with you? You ain't sacrificing my daughter. Sorry about that, y'all. I got a little heated. But hey, y'all will understand if y'all had kids. I don't even have kids, but still, I, that's what I would be on. You ain't finished. You ain't sacrificing shit. You better take your ass down into the Bohemian Isle sacrificial little, excuse me, sacrificial little area. Y'all know what the fuck I'm talking about. Where they be apparently sacrificing babies and shit and take your ass over there and put your ass on the front line, bitch. You ain't sacrificing shit. Anyway, y'all, this was an interesting trailer. It looks crazy as hell, but it looks like it's going to be good. So, don't forget, Awake comes on Netflix June 9th. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. Comment below your thoughts. Let me know in the comments section, despite us still being in a pandemic, right? What are some movies that you guys are looking forward to seeing? Me, personally, I cannot. Number one, because I'm a fan, for sure. Uh, the Conjuring 
The Devil Made Me Do It. That comes out next month as well. I'm very excited for that film um, because it's been a minute. And not to mention, they pushed it back because of the pandemic last year. So I look forward to seeing it. Uh, a Quiet Place too, especially since I saw it uh, earlier this month, like for the first time. Like, yeah, I mean, you can't see everything all the time. So don't judge me. So I look forward to seeing that. Uh, Candyman, whenever it comes out, I think it comes out in August. Because Nia DaCosta, the director, she really wants people to go see it at the theaters. And it's like, girl, you better hope this hype come back up for it. Because, I mean, that trailer came out in, like, early 2020. It was supposed to come out in June, but because of what happened, it got pushed back to September. Then it got pushed back again to this year. So, girl... You better figure it out. You better start promoting this shit again because I have heard nothing else about it. I hope it's not canceled. Girl, you better put that movie out and stop playing with us. I got to wait all the way till August. The fuck? But that's okay. I'm going to wait. And you guys, let me know what else I can react to for you guys. Hit that subscribe button. Follow me on Instagram. Hit that notification bell so you guys know the video uploaded. And I'll see you all in a minute. Taylor Rain. I'm out.